so I don't know if anyone can hear that. It might just be the tech inch foe that, uh, tech issue that was just causing us issues beforehand. But welcome to Pokemon Legend of the Arena! Last time we made our way to our home and had a battle with our brother, he. It took us two tries because our brother was one hell of a battle. My oh my, he caused us some trouble, we had to take him twice, and then we made our way here to... Everman Island, and now let's continue. I'm supposed to go through, as far as I can tell, no one else here is a trainer. And here's Sunset Storm Village and Dragon Master Amon. I'm positive that's Dragon Master. Amon. I thought the Dragon Master deserved a welcome committee. Banners, flags, a horde of aggressive fans clamoring for autographs. And yeah, that issue is our technical issue. You come right back to haunt me just as we start. Give me a minute, guys. I'm gonna do what I can to fix this. Quick. I might be distracted trying to fix this. I really apologize. I thought I had it working, but it apparently decided, hey, you're about to stream. And it wanted to start right up again, so I apologize for that. I might distract it, and while I'm trying to fix this, I'll keep going, but I'll try not to be distracted too much while trying to fix this. Hey, you there. Me? Yes, you. Tell me, where I might find a certain Gabriel Gabriel son? Gabriel? I don't know. He's usually the one who finds me. Hmm. Well, if you see him, tell him the Dragon Master must speak to him at once. Um, okay? Tell him I have a, I have a, a game of Ma Mahjong scheduled for five. I have a better question. Why are you playing Mahjong right now? Ma what? My king's gun. Don't have a duck eater. Why do I particularly want a king's con? I change him change his form depending on uh, what from weather or condition. Right now she's hiding away inside her petals. And then bright sunshine, she opens up like a happy flower. That if I sunbathe too much, I'll look like a flower. But it's so nice out here. As long as you don't go. Yeah, that's Laura with. Oh, hey, Aeon. What's up? Liz's been telling me how much of a drug it actually uh, is. Whoa! I said nothing of the sort. It's just. Look, in my pop out of your work, I spend a lot of time with herbs. And there are some that. Well, I have other effects. That I came, came across, across by accident. accident. Mm -hmm. Sure. You, you come, come across, across a lot of shroomish leaf during a pop carry work? Oh, oh screw you. What, what I do with my downtime is not your business. Guess the name of our next episode. Oh, it's gonna be Lizzie, Lizzie here. I'm, I'm going, going to go, go find my old college, college flatmates. And, and there's, there's nothing, nothing you can do about it. I don't care what you're gonna do with your college flatmates. Wow, dusty. Yeah, yeah probably, probably has the potential to be a good B story, story though. though. Oh, oh, what? what? Never mind. You going into the jungle soon? But I might guess. Poisonous plants, dangerous, and high level Pokemon? Should be fun. Sweet, you fancy going up to the top of the mountain? Sure, why not? Something tells me important stuff is up there. The only one to find. One way to find out. Last one. There's a sun skirt. God, you're such a nerd. Why do we even hang out? I. What? Yeah, over here. Pokemon Center, because we probably need to get up. And over here, a slight change to our party. I know I should probably not do this, but I'm a little... 
Uh, it might be a slight change, or I'm gonna look at them. As you remember last episode, we did catch a uh, Rosa. Zalia? I'm gonna check on its moves. Never mind, there will be no change to the party. Because, let's be honest, that is. Terrible move sets. And I don't think we're gonna be able to go find Mr. God or whoever teaches him, and no way we're gonna be able to teach her a better move, so that Rosalia is, and there's Gabriel. Yeah, you're saying yourself at last. Allow me to introduce you to someone. Okay, but first, this is your vitamin flower, the next for an extraordinary biologist and filmmaker. He's making a documentary about the jungle, and he said we can be in it. Think about it, and we'll be on television. We're already on television, are we? Well, yes, but that's... PCNN. They get horrible ratings. This will air on PCXX. Is this supposed to be an FX reference? It's premium cable, baby! Okay, I think Dragon Master Aiden wants to speak to you. To speak to you. The Dragon Master? He's here? Oh god, give me strength. Hey, isn't he like a living legend or something? Well, he used to be, but now... His ego's taken over completely, and I don't have time for his crap. Alright, you go on with Richard. I'll try and catch you up. Don't, but don't start fumbling with that. Oh well. In this scene, the young hero approaches the esteemed biologist. In what must be an attempt to initiate a stimulating conversation. Um, what? Yet his attempts, though valiant, have proved to be unsuccessful. Because you're apparently filming this. One cannot help but help, help but wonder what will happen next to this dynamic duo. They're gonna make a film that's apparently so shit. Nerds, nerds over here. Seriously, what is with your comment against nerds? <laughs> We're in the jungle, this is probably Hugo's turn for leveling now. We're still training up Polly as well. We probably will not be able to get, remove these feet. But you're not a trainer? Welcome to the jungle, the most unforgiving place in Aria. If you want to survive, then you should follow a few rules. Don't interact with plants and Pokemon you don't recognize. Don't try to make a documentary about the local wildlife. And never ever walk through this the grass that's suspiciously soft. You got that? Sorry, I was distracted by a bug. What a man, it's your funeral. Alright, we might end up doing a small stream today because of unfortunate technical difficulties. Then, sir. Find a decent grass Pokemon in here, but the rare, the bra. I mean, if we catch it, we can level it at least once. We could get a ground type or, or a dragon because oh, wait, no, is Flygon Dragon Flunk? Well, well, we'll see if we can catch it.
Oh yeah, so it is a ground dragon already. Yeah, we'll probably switch it out. We may switch it out for jump bluff. Okay, there's the trainer battle. Ha, ah, I got you. There's no flying away from this. Really, you're a flying trainer? And a grassy jump? In this jungle where we should be attacked by grass ball? <laughs> I don't like the battle. Uh, at least he's the dog starter. Alright, so he is using the dog for some gas. So we can still burn right through him. This turn, no matter what. There's the electric type flying type you're expecting this guy to have. Well, I mean, now that we're expecting him a pure flying type, you know what I mean. We're expecting a pure electric like, flying type. So I'm really just sorry, but like we ran into a technical difficulty just as we started. Again, I thought I had the technical difficulties fixed, but I'm still trying to fix them as quick as I can while we're going through this, but they're getting distracted and they're taking my focus right now. They're starting to be extra difficult today. I'm really sorry about that, guys. As much as I want to attack you again, I don't think fighting a ground dragon is going to really help us right now. Weeping bell. To raise our Pokemon in hostile environment. They grow up tough. I was promised fire types. Where are my fire types? Grass types. This is a jungle. Because I need something to get rid of that Hitmo Chan. And honestly, the Hitmo Chan probably first. Okay, 
Rayburn and Psychic Christian Casey out to feed us, and we do that away. Oh, I was gonna say, don't tell me Rayburn is not effective enough. Huh? We're affected by the. Okay. We'll pray for it again, and what we're doing. We'll hyper potion up for that man. Yeah, they're just not stopping with the, uh... Fighting types from her, which means I can't throw. If you get an unparalyzed, I'm gonna go close combat with you. Okay, close combat, we should heal up with left over anyways. Damn, I didn't want to talk to you but... Well, we at least got rid of Munchlax. Oh my night man, it's gonna take more hits now. Sorry, slowly healing up. And our next Pokemon is Raichu! That's psychic Raichu. There you go, hit my top. So at least this should now be a 2 on 1 matter what we fight now. Okay, he wastes time with a nasty plot, that's good. And Nightman is still suffering from paralyzation. Okay. So I'm gonna close combat. Because that should hopefully do enough damage. I mean, if he uses a thunder attack anyways, we're down on Zora. And he outspeeds us this time. Which is weird, because he did not outspeed us before, and I don't think nasty plot increases the speed. Or was I not looking enough to see? That's psychic at least, well, the problem now is our advantages are behind him. But we'll throw a jump off him and heal up Hero. And now we're going to have over 90 lives, and we should have over 90 because we had like 15 before and we bought 99, so we should have plenty of revives. I would have been so happy if he survived with us. Man, Nightman's not doing well with paralyzation. Hugo's gonna have to be our ace here. And I just used Lava Plume instead of Flamethrower, that was not the right move. And I'm gonna actually have Nightman heal up Hugo. How's everything going with you guys? You guys are already able to heal me, right? You hear me, right? That's not a weird move for a right you know, to be honest. He was gonna finish right you off. That man gets a level up, but that second gets wasted. And I think he still has one more one chance to I definitely need Nightman here, so I'm going to use a uh, full heal on Nightman. So Nightman can get us close combat. Because I don't think Chansey is a fairy type in this. Because I don't think fairy type is actually in the game. Critical. And it's a yeah, so fairy type is not in the game. I think this is technically before Gen. Honestly, I don't think anything past Gen 5 at least is in here. Battle of Hostile Environment. Shambles, complete and shambles.
archives first. Too bad. I should give up some water to grass types. I want to burn some grass types. Bug Torque Sail. Especially because I, I really do think is Lily was given a tiny bit of focus here. And as we noticed from the past couple of chapters, rounds, the grass type is. That's just. Okay, as far as I can tell, Dark Punch is not an actual move, so I have no idea where they came from. I should have switched to a fight, because I have to be honest. I will find a punch this time. It's going to jump now, and it's got 80 power! Great tech, I guess. Attack again, okay. No fun distance. Like him? Alright, he was level 56, good. Inferno! Let's see, what does exactly this Inferno do again? I, I always look these up, but. 50 sh accuracy, I'm not gonna teach a Pokemon 50 accuracy moves. Probably yes. Uh, Ice type is probably more coverage here, but I wanna. I guess I'm almost expecting Fuel is gonna be the one we need the most. For the next battle, so I want him to get as much as speed as possible. And the only reason I'm not getting these speed all off him is because, well, let's be honest, I'm probably gonna see it all off. So, oh no, this is bad, very bad. I was guarding that item box, now what will I do? Max propels! Honest to god, we could avoid that because, ah, uh, whatever. I'll take the max repels. I mean, honestly, I rarely try to rely on repels. There's a documentary crew who's doing some filming around here. You get to be on television and finally the big time. You won't, man. You ever been to, to a podcasting contest? I had a lot of those contests back in like golds, our gold and soul silver. Man, yeah, they were. They were always so random. Like you would literally catch like an amazing Pokemon you think was amazing, and they would win and beat you by pure luck. Honestly, that's something I consider well designed for a game. I need to take a drink, and I have to do everything one-handed right now, because... I'm holding the... Ch the charger that is, um... Did it to work normally, I'm holding it... In place, and if I move, I'm afraid it's not going to charge again. And I don't want it, make it not charging again, and I have no idea if when it will start charging, so... Until it's pretty much fully charged again... I'm holding it against my hand. Pick it soon. You should be able to kill that. You 
Yummy. Da, 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 da. I love dinosaurs. Oh man, a camera. I don't really love when they give you the type you need. Perfect grinding fur. Who are you? Oh, Licky Licky is not. We're gonna have to fight him anyways. Firework, that's... Vertical hit! And then... But that was less critical, and I should have used Critical Attack instead there, but... Whatever. Back to Tropius. And we go for another level train. Jeez, we're running out of these rather quick. We do not have any of those. I think. Well, hopefully we'll find a heal station soon. If not, worst case, I'll check for ethers. The upside, I am not going to. Oh, yeah, I should probably heal up too. But we'll see if we have any ether while we try. Alright, we have four elixirs, so... We're not... I'm gonna actually give this PP up to you over here. Feels fine throw up a little more. What the rarest Pokemon in the jungle is? Is it Riolu? She should be so bad. Oh, Just heal this guy up too, we're already probably gonna need to reach heal him. Better call a little too late, but hey, we can tough us down and he will almost get the next level up. Apom, we're gonna definitely switch out to Apom for Sora. You know, Sora does need the speed too, and honestly, I'm gonna probably take the speed share off Polly soon and go to Sora. That was next level up. Damn, almost enough. Water roll, quick attack for this round, and then shot the 8 pump. And Sora should get some. Not too good, are you correct? Minus five marks, but I never gave an answer. Protector is Tangaro. You have a 1% chance of encountering. Okay, that's cool. I did not know that, but... You know, we have encountered it. I think. If we do, maybe I'll try catching it for the team. I don't know, because we're most likely going to switch out. Jump off. Alright, it's so another weaving bell. If it survives, we catch it. And if it survives, we don't catch it. Oh, they're both 57 now. Alright, so at that point, no, since he's close, I, uh, I'm I guess I'm down. We're gonna remove... Polly. And give it Sora. I don't really want to take the XP share off him, but Sora is also... Or not the speed share off him, the, his leftover is but Sora is definitely one of our lower net levels now, he's the second lowest level. And everyone else is a decent level now, other than Jump Off. So I mean, I 
no one expected. Oh wait, no, it is leftovers. So, we'll switch and give him his leftovers just because you are probably a little more better standing health wise. Aw, oh, Bulbasaurs! Can we catch him, please? And so the male Bulbasaur cautiously approaches its female counterpart by taking the initiative and approaching her in the wild. He has proven himself a worthy mating partner. They will likely be devoured by wild scythers in a week, but for now, it seems our young Bulbasaur male has found love. And they ran a right cut. God damn it, the kid was in the shot. Oh, sorry. The scene biologist finds this news very distressing. He may be inclined to use the tranquilizer gun in any future account. What the fuck? No, I didn't move the character to do that. He apparently did that himself. Why have you sent it into the dark depths of the jungle? Come, Sparks. This is a. Ch You're a psychic trainer. Stick to your. S I had you. Really? You know, go wrong. I just won't get one out of hyper fucking potions, don't you? I can't repair. What's his next? Source 51. Nice. That's all. Okay, I think we. Uh, it's rock, so we're definitely gonna go rock psychic, so we're gonna throw out Holy and hope we have speed. Sir! Hey! Where's my wave? Hey, you have speed, but we didn't use our effects, so what? Our group won't go off? Well, I didn't need it since I haven't taken any damage. Oh. Rafferig, I'm gonna switch out for... I guess Hugo, because he's the only one I think that can stand up to him. I mean, not that Night Man can't, but I can't imagine... I'm my last flamethrower. So, alright, let's go back to Paul. Actually, no, let's do Sora. And give him a boost to XP with each speed share, because I think with XP share you actually get more as well if you're the, the fighting Pokemon. And you can intimidate the Absol. And plus, we got close down that. Clearly, it's Gamble move, but it is being very effective for us. It really does work well for Star Raptor. Chaos Reigns! Okay, we don't have a cut Pokemon on us, so we can't get that item. Which sucks. And I'm not gonna engage with Tangela. Mostly because, you know, I don't have anyone to engage with the Tangela. The game's really not gonna tell me how to need to go and get cut just for this area. This oak oh, tree, you so silly. You have to move out of the way so I can get past. What the hell was that stupidity? Oh, we got three heavy balls. I'm not sure when we'll use them, but hey, Pokeballs are Pokeballs. And guys, you should interview him. He's much more interesting than me. Yeah, I actually have a unique sprint. Oh no, I shouldn't. Ma, come on, we're talking about nature and stuff. Okay, okay. 
The steam biologists process this disturbance. So, Aeon, what are your thoughts on this jungle environment? Too many bugs and it smells like the, uh, the D, Indeed it does, indeed it does. And what's your opinion on the mating rituals of Tangela? I mean, if they can get their minds in order, then hats off to them. Very good. Back to the studio. Really, this is most improper. What are you talking about, Pritchard? This is how you do television. Yeah, I reckon this guy could take some tips from us. Definitely, he's got no presence, no charisma. And we know how to work the crowd. A uh, guy behind? What? Can't you handle our next level reporting skills? Oh my god, run! Please let us ch ca catch it, please let us catch it. Say, why don't you feel this one? What? Ugh, fine. Good luck. Um, nice Pokemon. Ah, oh, this Pokemon cannot be caught. It's gonna be a Mega Venusaur, watch. And it's a Mega Venusaur, level 60. You will come on, be our ace. Level blue! Wow, that did not do a lot. And literally, that was our last. Oh, let's go for Thunder Coke and hope we paralyze him. We cannot. Foolish Venusaur. Yes, we got the paralyzation. We're exceeded, so we're in some. Alright, looks like I need to go for him. Alright, we have one other, so let's we'll use that instead. Alright, we're gonna restore Flamethrower. So we're gonna need it here, to be honest. Okay, we got the first paralyzation off. Burn him to the ground. Man, he doesn't. Oh, he has synthesis! No biggie. We can start our last one. Fire should, but I guess... Oh, god damn it. He's still... Oh, agree. Fire should definitely be grass, but... Looks like this Venusaur has got some good defense. Okay, that's... Unfortunate. We're gonna leech seed. Right, we'll switch into jump block. We should still be able to do at least a hit on him. I wanna just use Le Oh shit, that's right, he's grass. It doesn't affect it. So he's gonna pedal dance us. Hopefully we'll survive it. Okay, we do. Yes, we do. We're gonna use this time to heal up and revive Hilo. I'm just disappointed we can't catch this Venusaur. Okay, now it's confused, so that should also hopefully work to our benefit. And I'm gonna take this time to fully revive Heal up. Heal here. You hurt yourself. Yes. All right, we survived. Anyway, let's go for an acrobatics and see what we can do to this little sar here. All right, hurt yourself. Come on, hurt yourself again. Took in solar beam. And what do you know? We beat the sar with with our 43 jump club. Sora's 52. Sadly, we couldn't catch him. The wild Venusaur ran away. That wasn't like any Pokemon I've ever seen. What was that? So I was slightly wrong. I did forget both the Mega Gyarados that we saw last stream and this, but this is the only thing... Wait. Does that mean Blissey did have the Fairy type? I did see something similar with the Gyarados on Route 20. Really? Yeah, something strange is definitely going on. Well, okay. We'll talk to Gabriel when we get back.
But for now, let's keep going. I think we're almost at Peppermint Mountain. I mean, this chapter in our lives isn't over yet? Not even close. See you at the peak. We actually had to heal up. Alright, looks like this is the kind of grass we can't ride our bike in. At least hopefully... Let's see if we can at least catch the sight there. I got you! Oh, clever girl. So, does this mean it's a trainer battle? Oh, it's just two Scythers in one. Still have no PB for a loud throw. Psychic, I guess? Well, we got one. Night Slash. You know what I might do? If we can catch this guy, let's just growl. Please don't hit him again. Quick attack. We don't quick attack this time. Let's go for a. Uh, I'll be honest. A night slash knowing scyther would actually. Be, it's possible. Ah, oh, you're telling me we can't catch it. <laughs> well, we took on one sight there. Only Sora got to walk away with that happy. So yeah, I guess it's gonna be the trainer equivalent of a battle. Ideal station, that's good. Six thousand. Yeah, it's still not good. And alright, let's save quick. Moltres? What was that? I think that was Moltres, guys. Arr, that'd be Moltres. Who? The Great Bird of Fire that rests the top Peppermint Mountain. Arr, she'd be the most powerful creature on this mountain. Fair Isle. Arr, okay. Ooh, if we can catch a Moltres, that would definitely... Especially... Oh my god, is it demon me? Oh, great. And now you're here. Things just couldn't be better. Apparently not challenging him? Evil Aeon isn't here! Alright. Welcome to Peppermint Mountain. Please take care, we're walking around hot lava. It's really hot. No, we will not be burned by walking around the hot lava. Hot lava fumes collide with the cold air to generate precipitation. Neat. Click. Okay, so... Tourist. Is that lava down there? Wouldn't that make this a volcano? Do I look like a geologist? Yeah, sorry, we're not Randy. The elevator is out of order, so it looks like you're hiking, boy. Ha! Ah, why don't you laugh at me? That's just me. Sorry, I got so okay at the moment. Alright, as long as we don't have to use, like, strength or anything, because I'm not teaching anyone strength right now. Okay, so we can find fire types here. Magma. Yeah, I'll catch them, why not? Sunny day. Sometimes I miss the fact that we don't have flash fire. But yeah, we didn't get programmed with hidden abilities. Wait, 
Shot the Magmar. Heaven or hell, let's rock. Why did you not challenge me before? Alright, let's see what they got here. Dragonair and Tropius. Not the best combination for us. Alright, let's flamethrower Tropius and I guess we'll psychic Dragonair. This Elise. Once we get Tropius out of the field. Okay, I was. I think that would move him, but I guess not. Aquateo, I'm definitely going to have to mic try my combo. It's really weird to use the least tornado on him. Oh, that's a sign of it. Okay, this is the sign. Level punch. Dragonair, I think, is a weak... Okay, it's not flying. I thought it would be at least flying, but I guess it's just a dragon. That psychic was wasted. Travius. We would have killed Travius. Okay. Sorry, Rush. Shouldn't be too effective against us. Okay, an Aerodactyl. That's. Well, let's try. Oh, no, that's just bad. Oh, yeah, it's not. That is. Always weird as that. Let's see. Okay, we took out Dragonair. And Sharkito. We're gonna have to Thunder Punch that and Magnum will be for this. I was so hoping he would aim at Duo. No, whatever. Duo should at least get the Thunder Punch. But we still have lowered accuracy, so that's shit on us. And we take a Night Slash. Throw Polly then, because Polly at least has wake up slap. So should hopefully be able to knock out Sharpedo. As long as Duo survives like, come on, Duo with a thunder punch. Oh ball squad, and he pop. Well, enough scale with respect to that. Now, if he aimed that actually at Paul Lee, I would laugh, but I don't think that was actually aimed at him. Rough snake's always annoying, but Paul Lee wins against Sharpedo. And should be able to take Aerodactyl on himself. And of course, he's got leftovers, so that's less worried or something. Alright, we'll throw Sora out for the quick attack and. Plus, Sora will at least get a boosted XP, I think, again. Ice Punch Aerodactyl. Yeah, I wasn't expecting that to do much, but I figured that would do much. Yeah, Crunch would not do much against it. Sora's 53. That'll definitely out. Three rocks too hard. Right, I'm just gonna revive up and heal instead of go out and heal just for the. Because I really don't want to spend the 6,000. Also makes me wonder. Ah, oh, another item that's. See, this is what I hate about Kiki moves. You, know, you want to be able to catch that stuff. Alright, Magmar, I'm not going to fight or try to catch again. It's actually sort of Polly. Since you're most likely a fire type trainer, we'll switch to Polly. God, I wish we had an earthquake. That would be like the best move to give Hero. You're out of your mel element, boy. Boy. Fire be the match. Guard. Take it 
What happened to the, you know, it throws out water? Weezing, we'll switch it to below that. right back into duo. And by hero I mean Polly. So I did say I was a little distracted because of the technical issues. But it mostly should be fixed now, but I'm still keeping an eye on it still it's something I'm paying attention. I'm gonna pay attention to. Bad luck then after the delay of an hour we still ended the running two again. Sunny day shouldn't bother us right now. Magic about to end anyways. But critical. That yeah, was super effective. We didn't need the crit, but hey, I always appreciate crit. How is that even possible? Because I obviously knew what you're gonna have. Not gonna fight him again because wild team. Hope. And we check out this fertile soil so that could go things here. That's a really weird th thought, but apparently yes, you can do that. Torkoal. Oh, it just barely survives. But it's only gonna do that thing. You need to off, so. Yeah, just for the music dot, I'm gonna ice punch. Oh, you yeah. would Oh, you're That's an amusing statement, because despite what we just saw, that was not actually that effective. But we'll surf and knock him out. Probably slowly getting yourself back to Alright. This is the perfect time to just surf. And just be oh god. Okay, but as long as we get the chance to switch up. Okay, we body slam Torkoal there. Alright, now let us switch out. Come on. Okay, so we're not going to be able to switch out, so I'll, I'll stay in there, I guess. We're going to have to wake up. Oh, shh. Woo! That's lucky. Come on. That did a lot. When you remember where... Oh shit. What did I But, since we pretty much outspeed him, we're gonna switch him to Sora. So we only just need that one little slower left. We're gonna knock him out with Link Attack, and Sora gets a lot of XP. Because, you know, Sora's also gonna be pretty useful. Oh man, we ruined your thoughts, so I mean, probably not. Alright, well, let's revive Polly up. Because I honestly do think Polly's gonna be pretty good in this. up facing Lizzie, who I'm almost positive is a grass type trainer. We're just gonna have our abundance of at least grass types. We're gonna need all these ice beam oh really? Can't stop. Let's 
fine. Not worry about the fire punch. No, oh, I guess we're gonna surf because I did that by accident. Man, it's weird that he survives that. And I spoke to the funniest, funny thought of putting, putting down a fire type and an ice type move. Oh. Alright, we actually do need to go this way. This is a weird ass cave. We will not fight the Magmar this time. And we can't escape again. That's really weird. Nope. Got away safely this time. Yeah, I swear, that's three times in a row we failed to escape from a Magmar. The first time. Like, what gives with that? Fuck, it is blocking my ability to sense your aura. Now I gotta wonder, why does Pokemon games never think to bring up aura? I mean, you gotta bring out the psychic types. I really should have switched out, though. Yep. And on that note, retreat from pa the Polly to Hilo. Never mind, this is another move. Another move. We really do need to get a dark type move, which makes me really kind of sad again. We did not get. Get one of those scythers, because that would have actually been really useful for us. Pause 58. Solarock. I'll switch back to the Poly Poly then. At least thinking Solarock is. Yeah, water is rock. So. Oh no, it's rock. It's fire. I was thinking of Lunatone. Almost, and it's going to be psychic, so. Polly's gonna go down here on a critical and a super factor. Well, we'll be reviving him again. Because I don't really expect there to be a uh, thing again here. I mean, I don't know, maybe we'll get lucky, but I think we're a little too close anyway. The beginning for that anyway, so we'll get to. Alright, uh, so we got a little more effect. Magic Room, and that's. Less worrisome, but we should finish this out with a quick attack anyways. So... Yeah, that's the thing we got rid of my Spacer. Okay, and slow bro. Well, if you can pull, you haven't had anything to do since you left. Since all those right now. Swimmers, water Pokemon, so... Let's take you off with Thunderbolt. Probably because we don't know what we're gonna do next. Revive first. I'll buy more revives in the next game, no. Excuse me. I killed the music there for a sec. We probably didn't need a Ohio, but whatever, we're healing up anyways. I'm glad the next thing we come across. Oh, hey, okay, it's your spot. Alright, can we escape from the Magmar? Nope. Every time. Okay, that's twice we can't escape from the Magmar. That's new. I might just have to start taking on these Magmars just because we can't escape from them. I love how the guy kept running 
even... Okay, we're just gonna take off the Magmar. Fuck it. Especially because they're not really giving us fire and ground types, which... Eh, what do you know? The Magmars continue to survive with a tiny sliver of HP, no matter how many times we take them out. Whatever. There's a level difference, and... I don't think it's because Paul is weak or anything. He's pretty decent for a water type. So that's 5, good for him. Okay, you want to challenge me? Yep. Bulk and Brawn, or Speed and Agility? That is the, is the question. You guys do know that that's not what his speech is about, right? Uh, Ariyama, and we're going to switch out to... I'm going to try Sora. I would just throw Nightman out, because he is psychic and fighting. He should be able to take a fighting attack. I'm gonna regret Brave Burning because we are low health, but it's an open line technique. I don't want to switch out to Nightmare right now. Alright. Ah, oh, the Miko killed us. This is why I usually don't rely on moves like this. I'll probably get most of the speed there. Alright, Nightman it is then. I'm honestly disappointed in that, but it's such a good move for Sucario. We could use Hero. Oh, whatever, we'll psychic. Oh, it's not even super effective. This is why you always use fire type Lucario. I'm not worried because the next attack should finish this off, anyways. And your fo force pumps are not that strong for us. This hasn't helped at all. Alright, so we'll revive up again. Always why it's good to carry revives. Especially what's been going on with us these last couple episodes. And because you know we do have some damaging moves. Ah, oh, sweet. Finally, we broke the streak of being out, unable to run away from Magmar for the first time. There's supposed to be an ancient Pokemon living deep inside this town. His fire type attacks are responsible for keeping up the pools of Magma. Where can I find this Pokemon? No idea. I guess you could try looking under a rock and stuff. Thanks, I'll do that. Well, I'm assuming it's talking about the Moltres, who we're gonna. Charcoal! That's actually going to be honestly good for you all. I will give it to him later. Oh, please tell me we're not going to need Rock Smash here. Ooh, Camera Ride. I'm going to try catching it because... Honestly, we could use a, probably use a good... Yeah, I was honestly expecting that Camera to go down one shot, but... I guess it, I mean, four times weak to water, so that was... Yeah, I'm still really hoping we don't end up needing... But yeah, we will definitely, if we catch the Moltres, battle the wild Pokemon is getting boring. I know, I'll battle you instead. Why didn't you battle me when I ran by you? Slap. Take out. That's an annoying, honestly, starting up when we're gonna give up, though. Double hit. Ah, one shot. Again. Damn, our 
ability to one shot Pokemon is running low. Jesus. It's weird seeing. Actually, not that should be. Second time he's lost it over. Well, keep it a little level up. That's good. Sora is not. Ampharos. Don't exactly have one, anyone in particular for him. I will throw out. Hero. And go for an out fight. Realization and they do a lot of time to boss. Oh man, oh, we're definitely gonna have to get them off again. But... Alright, so we're gonna turn this into a quick attack dog fight. And I guess we're gonna rely on this Nightman and Psychic for the rest of this. I really do want to. So how's everyone doing in the chat? Well, that backfired. Yeah, you. What a good fight, man. Definitely gonna need more hyper potions and revives. It's weird that I keep going back to the ball screen. Top, prepare to battle. Charmeleon. Yeah. Weezing, we'll switch into Hero. Actually, no, Nightman for Weezing. I don't usually normally use Psychic types, so I never can use. Use one against Weezing. Be able to do it again. All right, we're back to Holly. I have no idea what we're facing next up. Wow, burn down the jungle, burn down the system, burn down everything. I don't like mortar! Okay, this is gonna be fun. Almost a search still. I'm probably gonna, after this, when we get back in town, I'm definitely gonna buy Luthers or Elixirs or whatever we have as well. Because, I don't know, lately I feel like, or at least these couple of the last ones, Definitely need more of them. Let's go back more, and let's get us, hopefully this gets us to 59. It does. Woohoo! Sora's obviously not gonna level up. I'm burnt out. Hey, what's Laura doing here? Now it's gonna battle. I hope they don't have too many fire types because we don't have to You look hot and dehydrated, why not cool off on the battle? No running across the bridge, please. 
you did run, though. <laughs> ah, so they're Pokemon Rangers. Oh, you can take that Scyther on. Really a nice ice punch. I guess this is an option. Oh. Okay, I guess it goes combat. Despite not being very effective, that actually did a lot to him. Oh, but, I mean, as long as you don't... Yeah, that Ice Punch should be able to... Wow, that did... That did nothing. Nothing at all. Well... The leftovers... Between the leftovers... Okay, let's Ice Punch Victory Bell and let's close combat as well. See if we can't just turn this into one to worry about, not two. Yeah, definitely not disappointing with attack control. And that was Light Nightman's last attack, so you get knocked out. But Victory Bell takes him up. Help? Is it taken out, maybe? I guess, sorry, like I said, I'm just a little distracted right now. Play doll. Shit. Okay, hero, I guess. That's probably do not have a dark type. Okay, well... Actually, no, wait. Since he was out, we can Ice Punch Play doll, and we'll play and throw a cycle. Excuse me. It's also that late part of the evening where my allergy medicine is no longer helpful. Oof, we froze to play it all, that's at least nice. You don't have to worry about attacking us. The ride on, we will worry about. Especially, we can't. Actually, no, we can wake up some slap right on. Flamethrower for all of us. I hope that doesn't unfreeze him. It did. Wow, that is just terrible. Like, that was... What the hell did I just watch? Real one. That's not helpful either. Wow, that was a lot done for us. Okay, Star Raptor for Light on the Yes. Okay, let's play and throw a plate all, so that's one less problem to worry about. And close combat. we're fast enough to close combat right on. Nice. But we don't kill him. Which means heroes probably gonna die here. Yep. A critical and it doesn't even do enough to take down that eye. And their final Pokemon is a Blastoids. Huh. Oh, so I was gonna close on that ride on and we're never bolting Blastoids. Oh shit. I did not expect that to happen. Well, he only gets one round for that. So, so we're gonna finish it off right on. Final game, let's see what that does. User risks all to attack the foe. User faints, but does damage equal to health. That, I feel, is too dangerous of a move to use. Like, I get it, it's cool, but... Hydro Pump, but shouldn't kill either of us. Although Sora lowered his defense a lot. Man, this is some serious double battle. <laughs> Holy crap, they still have more Pokemon? How much Pokemon do they have? 
Day. Going to revive up you all. Now we'll probably bolt. Blast so we can actually kill him this time. I swear, is Dark Punch Sucker Punch or something? No, wait, Sucker Punch would have worked there, though. Yeah, we survived that. Oh, well, we get him paralyzed, that's... Nice, although that's gonna kill Dark Claw. We killed Dark Claw, how dare you? All he wanted to do was be a decent party member, since we had him just... Just give him a Finish off Blastoids here. Okay, well, to 58. Yeah, no, there's been no bonus experience for Star Raptor at this point in the fight. Alright, we took out Tacto. Hopefully that was their last Pokemon. Alright, we beat this part. Make any sense? I'm running out of patience. Ooh, that's a nice amount of money. Let's... I mean, we're all just gonna probably stop and heal up after this, but... I'm just curious what's gonna come up next. No, we do not battle you. Okay, so no... Oops. The wrong button. I paid to acquire my, acquire my Pokemon. You can pay. Did you get them from like coin cases? Like the one you like that? Gibble. Are you gonna handle a gibble? Get an ice punch. I mean, that was also a pretty weak gibble. Alright, yeah, right. That might be a little stronger. Okay, we're definitely gonna need to switch in for Charizard just because we don't have Surf right now, so we don't really have a way to fight Charizard. But Pika Pool can. You fully expected him to have something else, though, let's be honest. We all expect the Charizard. Okay, we're I really hope we get a heal station before we fight Moltres, or is it Moltres? Because we definitely need one. It's only money down the toilet. I mean, it's not your team was bad, but it could be bought a catch rare Pokemon, so I bought them instead. Boy, do I regret it. Oh, God, there's the mysterious ghost me again. Golem. Ghost me again. Oh god, we're gonna have to battle Ghost me again, or Dark me, or whatever. Go well, again, like I said I didn't have a battle you, man. I don't care. I... My Pokemon are beat and tired. They need healing. I know, I skipped the scientist, but... Let's be honest, our Pokemon are all beat in technical camera rods. I don't want to try catching you right now. Gibble! Alright, let's see if we can't catch the Gibble. Damn, Sushi was so close too. I, can't, I don't want to attack it, because like, if I do, I'm going to kill it.
that's how we feel about that. Come on. I'm not sure if I should worry about sand too, because we heal up every damage from the top. Okay, you know, I'm gonna try to slowly change my strategy. While I can't attack him, what I can do is at least... I might be able to at least put him to sleep. That might make this a little easier, so we're gonna switch into Jump Off. And we can't switch out! Ah, oh, that's right, because we're in Sand Tomb right now, so we're fucked. Alright, Ultra. Just gonna keep Ultra Ball in, I guess. I would like to try the heavy ball. Oh, damn. It's worse is we're getting a bunch of like freeze. Oh, I'll take that. It's gonna... That was nothing to it. Probably because we don't do that much to ourselves, so. We're screwed from the sand tomb, so we should be able to switch out now. And we're gonna uh, switch into jump cloth. Wow, it's 10 damage from Slash. Alright, so, Sleep Powder. Really? Man, you the level difference of like... A little less than 20. Make that a lot easier. Right, give us a Sleep Powder. Hopefully this gets easier. Will be a little easier now? And you will walk up. I mean, I would leech seed him, but I'm worried we'll kill him if we don't catch him during the leech seed. Really, you miss again? Okay, he's asleep again. You know what? I'm gonna try a leech seed. Just cause it. Man, he woke up again. Jeez. Jump off, you really make me want to replace you now. Your leech seeds, you, your sleep power is usually not this bad. Jump cloth. Okay, he's asleep. He should be in yellow after this, I think, so... We should be able to catch Jump Off here. We're not Jump Off. He's still green, but he's asleep and he's lost like what? Uh, four fish? Maybe a little more of his health? So I'm hoping we can catch him with an Ultra Ball here. Damn, this is one stubborn give up. Gibble does 
don't want to get caught. He's a yellow, he's asleep? You go, if you don't go down soon, we're, we're gonna kill you. Finally! We caught him! It nestles in... I'm not going to this description right now. Would you like to give it a nickname? Alright. We don't play a whole... Actually, no, I won't call him that just because I don't want to name my Pokemon that, but I will call him Chain. Oh. And you know I won't, I probably won't add him to the next Till after the next round. Hey, another Gibble! Lower level. But, you know, maybe if we didn't catch that Gibble, we would have had better luck with his 20s. I guess mysterious me is not, or ghost, or evil me, or whatever you want to call that shadow me. Is it locking the door anymore? I'm sorry, I'm having problems with the lift thing. No, I'll fix it. No, though. Where'd you like to go? Alright, let's cancel save, because I want to see one thing. What happens if we go to the, the save? Alright, let's go to the entrance and heal up. And once we get back, we'll try... Alright, so there's the... Okay, so we'll heal up. Oh wait, there's no kill spot is here, is there? I'm just thinking of the wrong area, aren't I? Alright, so we'll go right back in then. Go to the summit. But before we go to the summit, we're going to take a small break. Summit? Alright, going up. Save here. We'll take that small break now, and I'll see you guys in a little bit.
Alright, and we're back, so let's continue. Let's see, we're gonna have to fight team the. Fill the shadows, and there's a heal spot, just what we needed. Still six thousand. Oh, now we have like thirteen. All right. So is Ghost that's gonna finally do something? What are you doing here? What do you want from me? Okay, Moltres, come on, Moltres. Where are you, little brother? Ah, oh, we're flashing back to the beginning of the game, aren't we? Our very first fight with our rival. We found that pie cone he loved. Aeon! Excuse me. Like I said, allergy is a bad time of the night for me, evidently. Yeah, I'm fine. Alright. So where the hell is Moltres, huh? Must have flown away. The cheeky son of a... Uh, he's gone. Let's go. Hey. Now wait just a damn minute. I climbed all the way up to this mountain and for what? An anticlimactic? That, my more so little friend, is not how I roll. How about a battle? A battle? Yeah. The sun's shining, we have got a beautiful view. We don't want to end this adventure on a burn note, do we? No, I guess not. Okay. Alright, that's fair enough. Give me everything you got. I won't hold back. Okay. Ooh, we're fighting five Pokemon on the The first Pokemon is from Mega Beam. Mega, Mega Mountain. Alright, we're going to switch out and switch directly to Hero right away. This item up. Okay, she's gonna be so mean. Okay. Oh, don't tell. Wait. What? That's weird. Did she just use. What happened? Why did we take damage? Is she trying to say we got Rocky Field on here? Because that's a thing, yes. Well, her solar beam ended up doing nothing. Felix. We're definitely gonna stay in two steelers. And Flamethrower, because we got a sunny day field, so our fire attacks are boosted. Fuel is beast for this. Ah, oh, just. Oh, sturdy. Oh, you bastard. You would have earthquake. I mean, it's a steelix, so yeah, you would have earthquake. And okay, we're gonna do our jump pluck for a reminder. She's probably gonna heal up too. Nope, she goes for a stump edge. Which obviously, wow, great and super effective, which is still weird because we're a grass type. But whatever. Alright, we'll go with heal again, and I guess. Go for a flamethrower, and she doesn't heal up again. Ah, hmm. uh, critical! She had one health left, the critical is not dead. Okay. Flygon. Yeah, let's switch out to Polly and go for an Ice Punch. Ice Punch, I think, should still be 4 times three. And 66. Jeez, I was not expecting that. Damn. I guess it's got a life orb then. Our rage will die, hopefully, but she loses anyways, because Flygon. Oh, no, she's. So Flygon still lives. Okay, we'll go for. Quick attack on Sora. Unless she heals up here, because watch her heal up here. No, she's still gonna heal up. Weird. We 
Bio. You watch the old handle. Oh, I obviously could have gotten close combat in there and gone for that four times beat, but we're in a boosted view. Man, we 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 want to pressure. Sword stance. Okay, their attacks are shit. But that also requires you to survive. And you don't. I'm doing. Let's go delayed and close combat. I mean, if we do that, more than one will go for uh, close combat way. Sheesh, she's got some nasty plot. Special attack rows. Focus Sash. Right, she hasn't healed up once, so maybe if you don't survive this, we'll still be able to get a hit up on Sora. Most for the Dark Pulse. I mean, I saw that coming. Word. Yeah, that not being super effective would no change anything. Alright. We need a close combat, and if she heals up, the we need to was good. And that's where we're probably gonna go. Oh. Ooh, fire blast, but she missed. Yeah, wow, she really did not heal up once. Which is really weird. Here you do. Or, ha, you did it. Holy crap, where did that come from? I don't know. I'm in a better mood now, though. Thanks. You're welcome? Oh, I found this feather in the middle of our battle. You want it? Yeah, go for it. It's probably important for some coveted reason. Burnt Feather. We should go back to the arena now, right? You know, Aeon, I was thinking. One of us will probably be leaving the competition soon. And after that battle, well, I can see who is more likely to come out on top. Laura? Well, I'm not upset or anything. Don't worry, I'm not your brother. Sorry, too soon? Anyways, I can see the end of our journey on the horizon. And it scares me a little, you know? But we'll still be friends, though, right? After all this is over? Oh, of course. I wouldn't doubt that. I just think we should make the most... Please be Moltres. Hey, Mon! Hmm? I expect the Moltres to be bigger, more majestic, with flaming wings. Oh, great, this guy. Did you fly up here? Well, of course I did. The Dragon Master wouldn't exactly take public transportation now, would he? Haha. <laughs> Anyways, have you two seen Weltrace? I intended to add him to my team. Nope, sorry. He was gone when we got here. Really? How odd. Eva, where have you been? You flew off without me. Sorry, my Dragon Knight's a delicate creature. I thought you weighed us down. You weigh us down. Anyway, there's no Weltrace here. Only these two kids. How dispiriting. We're your parents anyway. I mean, Emma and Buddy. You're looking at your biggest competition. Meet Aeon and Laura. So that must mean... Oh, now I see the real that once. Hmm? Never mind, I apologize. I saw the end of your battle, by the way. It was rather spectacular. Of course, you have a way while to go until you take on the Dragon Master. But that looked like a step in the right direction. Who knows, maybe I'll actually have to fight for my title this time. Ha ha ha. I thought you two might be up here. It's time for the tournament. Cool. Can we get a lift back with you, Aemon? Certainly, the more the merrier. You coming, Aeon? Yeah. Sure, let's go. Alright, hold on to your butts. Wait, wait! Alright. Let's heal up. Thank you for it. We restored your Pokemon to full health. We hope to see you again. Alright. So uh, let's take a moment to switch one party member out. As promised, I'm probably going to need Magmar more, so I'm going to switch Magmar with Jump Fluff. Yeah, Jump Fluff, I'm sorry, buddy, but your time in the party is ended. I would add Gibble up into the party, but I'm almost positive Gibble is. 
hate to do this, but I'm honest, Gibbo is too low of a level for this. Since, like I said, we'll probably need fire type moves. Lose our fire type, we're gonna take away Gibbo's amulet coin. Give him that, but we will give Magmar the amulet coin to hold. I would add the grave. All right, I'm almost positive we're gonna be fighting Lizzie. That's why I'm focusing on fire types. I'm gonna save quick. All right. All right. Since we got 15 minutes. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna see what we can do in the battle. I might go for revives and see if we can win this anyways. But I don't know if we're gonna save or not. If we can't win, I will do some grinding for tomorrow and try to level up as high as I can our team. Round 6, Sunstone Village Sega. Before we begin, let's open up our brand new sunroof. Does this mean the field's going to be all sunny? Oh dear, it looks like I'm dressed for the wrong weather. We have a parasol though. So let's see what this does for the field. And our first Pokemon moment is a Corsola. Ooh, but yeah, it looks like yeah, we are going to be fighting in a sunny day field. Which is really weird, because the game hasn't done this for most of it, but whatever. Thunder Punch. Earth Power, that was unexpected for a water type, but whatever. Is why would you switch into a type that my electric attack would hit you double anyways? Oh, well, it survives anyways. But gets paralyzed anyways, and we'll go for a quick attack instead of uh punch this round. We'll stay in for course because I think we can finish cross a lot anyways. And I used Quick Attack by accident. My bad. They go for a flail. Really weird. Okay, punch. Source. Alright. Okay, Gyarados. We'll stand. Level 6. Ooh, and a critical, I love it. That is why we taught QO or Thunder. Politoed. I'll switch out for Politoed. And let Pika Pool take the shot. No level 60. Swagger. You're gonna confuse us. Oh, he hit through the computer. Oh, the beat belly. Not fair, the sun was in my eyes. Hey, Kirk. How do you know I stick up all the way from Salt Square City? No, you didn't! Pretty sure you couldn't have done that, cuz. Alright. Right. Intimidate's annoying, but. Whatever, we'll come upon it. That did not do as much as I wanted to, but whatever. Close combat. But we should be able to finish off this turn. Nope. But Greybird should finish him off. Himself off. Damn! That's not helpful. Alright, I guess we're gonna switch in for Sora. Or, we'll switch in for Polly. 
Cool. The fact that we're fighting on a field where water is now weakened is a little annoying. We're fighting a Rapidash. But we've got leftovers and... Where else bad? How annoying. Oh, for as long as we can outlast Rapidash, we're good here. And we drew for Star After, who doesn't actually do better in this case. That just means the Star After went down my pole. And probably got to heal up a little more, so nice. Okay. Let's let's see if we can survive the play Let's we do, and that means it's the end for Rapidash, because Surf's gonna kill him. I hope he has no other fire types because we can't. The metric, I'm gonna switch into Huo. That actually would have been a good time for the drag on, but. Or bounce on it. There's no way we can train him. Okay, as long as he doesn't have quick attack, we should be able to do some serious damage to him here. Because we should have Blaze and Sunny Day up, so that many attributes. Or we can do a press. We defeated Peter. Okay, okay, I got the boat. Don't judge me. Of course you got the boat. You, there's no way you could have biked here. Alright, number three. The cameraman? This is my big moment, so smile for the camera. Cameraman, all of you would like the issue. Okay, climb door. Burn door press! My chance! Alright, we'll go Sora. Brave Bird, you can't Brave Bird anymore. Damn that recoil. <laughs> this one is level 16. Magma Zone? Oh, that's definitely Hugo. My guess, sturdy, yep. Not bad with the discharge, but Magnum goes down, I think that was his last one. Oh no, I thought for a second the window closed out. Alright, we defeated all No, I forgot to press record. Wow, and you just got your ass kicked. That's actually a good thing for you. Hey, what's up, AM, bro? Um, hey, Lizzie. Man, you're actually, like, such a cool guy. We should hang out more. Maybe we could get some snacks to Oh my god, she's high. Are you stoned right now? What? No. No, baby. Isn't it obvious? Is everyone staring at me? Oh god, I'm freaking out. This is the worst day of my entire life. Let's just battle, shall we? Oh, I'm sure. I'm, like, totally up for that. Alright, let's see how we can do against Lily. I'm almost positive she's gonna have grass types. Aurora? Ooh, she's got six Pokemon. My first Pokemon is Tropius. Man, this would actually be a perfect time for an Ice Head attack. But, and we're out sped. But, Tropius goes down anyways. Man, this might just literally be Hero's time. Viper, okay, we'll switch out for some Viper because Nightman is definitely gonna take that poison better. Okay, C3 is not too bad. Ooh, crit! And super effective. There goes down for some Viper. Come on, use that. Executor? Oh, we're definitely gonna go heal for that. Ooh, 
Ooh, 65! Psych, that's a little worrisome. Oof, come on, we can survive for the blaze! And down goes Executor! Victory Bell, okay, as long as we're not outspun. And we're by the by Victory Bell, so who's gonna go down here? Alright, but it ain't over yet. Let's go in Mike Barn and see if we can't weaken up Victory Bell. Uh, plus, I do want to rely on the fire. Wow, he was only fire typers. Damn, that's powerful about Slug Bomb. But he goes down in the end! Sorry, that's 61. Tango, alright, we'll stay for Tango. 66, and we're slower, but he doesn't get his hit off. But we don't finish him off. Alright, come on. He gets the earthquake off. So there goes Night Bar in his only second fight on our team. And we honestly don't need him for that fight. Alright, Sora, you're up. Okay, let's Grey Bird. He uses Grow. She's gonna use Growth here. But if we can get a Grey Bird off. Do so that growth means nothing, and Tangaroth is down. <laughs> Jeez, that's a lot of experience. Pilot Plume, okay, we'll stand for Wild Plume, and Free Bird again. Okay, we're gonna get Slug Bomb. And she's gonna crit on the Slug Bomb. Jeez. Okay, we're definitely gonna need to revive here. So we'll throw Pika Pool out. Worst case, she gets static. Oh, that's best case, she gets static. I we do not just have 15 revives. Man, he's really going for the slug bombs. Alright, we're poisoned. But we're just gonna use that time to fully heal up the hero. Hey, we're again for 49, and I crushed through you a lot of them. <laughs> but no, we should be getting plenty of money back, so we should definitely be able to get up. Now it goes about Pika Pool, but let's see if he was out spat. And Flamethrower. Okay, we're out spat by Mario Pool too. Jeez. Right. Survive the slug bomb and down goes Violet Blue. Hero reaches level 60, and we defeated Elizabeth. That was groovy in the slightest. Uh, I was hoping to grind up a little bit, but whatever. Damn, that was crazy, 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 Rooney. Pretty spectacular. <laughs> Sorry. Nose. Will someone get her a glass of water or something? Can I tell you a secret AR? I mean, we're on live television, but go ahead. I was really worried about today's match. Like, really worried. Him, I suffer from anxiety, anxiety problems. Who knew that was a thing? So, uh, thanks for beating me, I guess. Now I can go back to my flower, flower shop and just chill out. I feel like I haven't chilled out in ages, you know? That sounds pretty groovy, Lizzie. I wish you all the best. You too, Aeon. You too. So yeah, my guess next, we're going to fight the scientist dude. I don't remember what he uses. And then it's going to be our final match with Laura. Wow, that was a real scorcher of a battle. No kidding, because I probably threw a Pokemon. I think I got slumber just look at tell me about it. I'm swinging like a grump peg. Nice, here's your shiny thing. Round six metal. So that's six metals out of how many? Eight. Then you'll be in for a shot at the championship cup. Go check some man. Where's my free stuff? But we're running out of ideas, so Shell Bell. Shell Bell, get out of pocket. What the hell is this thing? 
shot from the beach, but we left it to the last minute. Okay, there's no need to drop any crumble, crumble. Anyways, let's hear it for our champ at been making. Aeon! Alright, and on that note, guys, we're gonna call it for tonight. This was a fun stream. I'm glad we were able to get the technical difficulties handled, and no issue there, but everything worked out in the end. We got a little delayed here, but it was a good stream, and we went a little farther than I expected. I'm sad we didn't get Moltres. Alright, until next time, guys. This is the next show, signing off.